Hello friends, do you like freaky, creepy, spooky and paranormal videos? Boy, have you come to the right place. Today, we're checking out King Frostmere. Without further ado, let's check it out. Like right now. Mohammed has uploaded the following video, which turned out to be quite interesting. He works construction and states that he had seen quite a few strange things over the past years. The following night, he was one of the only people preparing a new construction site close to an old mine when he noticed something unusual in the distance. Oh, there was someone walking there, yeah? Like a black shadow. Did you see it? It's a shadow creep. Who is that walking there in the middle of the night as well? He was supposed to be alone at work. We can clearly see a terrifying shadow figure walking by. Yeah. Mohammed states that this certainly wasn't a colleague of his or a person related to the construction site in any way. He and why also is he there? that this entity is not the only one appearing near the mine. They claim to have witnessed a floating woman that made horrifying crying noises. Pretty strange oh. to say the least. I have no idea what's going on here. Me neither. Perhaps it is a shadow being that was captured here. Maybe. You guys hear anything? <laughs> this chilling video was shared by a young woman named Poopa who found herself Poopa. home alone when something truly unsettling occurred. Sorry. The footage begins Poopa. innocently enough with Poopa lounging on the couch. However, her tranquility is abruptly shattered as she becomes aware of a lurking presence within her own house. Hello? You shadow creep, you. <laughs> what? It's completely black. Hello? Hello? Yeah, get the F out of here, man. You don't pay Dancing rent. towards the dimly lit corner of the room, she started to see what appears to be an immobile figure standing eerily still. What? It becomes evident that someone is watching her intently. Initially taken aback, Pupa's fear gives way to nervous laughter as she assumes it must be a mischievous friend or even her boyfriend playing a prank on her. The video then abruptly cuts off at a critical moment leaving viewers to ponder the unsettling events that followed. What happened after this remains a mystery. If it is a person, why is it, why is it completely black? It's just a shadow, man. Shadow man? No, not a shadow man. It's a shadow creep. Oh. As Poopa has refreshed That's creepy, from delving man. into the details of that fateful night in the following videos. A weirdo? The following video is quite I'm no a weirdo. strange one. And obviously Are you a weirdo? A bit older. It is said that a group of friends went to a supposedly haunted and abandoned building in the woods. There's a local legend about a Manangal creature that is stalking these parts of the woods. And some people swear to have seen it. The group arrived at this abandoned place in the hopes to capture it on video tonight. Let's take a look. Where's the weirdo? <laughs> what? Oh. That entity looked rotten as well. Like a dead body, you know, that has been dead for uh, some time. Right? Let's check it out again. I mean, it is certainly hard to say what exactly they what? came across here, I find. Some say that this thing reminds them of a vampire. 
Others believe Vampire? this to have been a prank with it's some a zombie man. Makeup. Well, what do you believe? A manangal or Uncle Hank with a Halloween mask? <laughs> Could also be the Hat Man. Oh. This was shared by Wade Lanigan, who is basically just hanging out with his son in the living room here. He has captured several strange incidents in the past and is recording video surveillance on the regular. Today, he regular. also suspects that he caught one of the several spirits that is said to haunt this home. That looked like a UFO, UFO flying by. <laughs> is it the hat man? Could it be? Yeah, come on. Is the effing hat man walking by? What? The figure of a shadow man with a large top hat can be seen as he's walking across the living room and reflecting in the mirror, which is quite a surprise to everybody. Oh. If it is residing in his home, or if it's a haunting that is bound to his family, is unknown. Many people believe that there's way more behind this. We have seen the hat man before, in uh, in a few videos back. Go check out my uh, other videos, please. <laughs> I got uh, loads of them. Then Wade is sharing with us, but who can say? What? You creepy ass hat man. The following video was supposedly captured by a tourist on vacation who was exploring a local temple that day. While well, just a few steps away from the location, he captured something quite strange right next to a statue. That's a weird place for a statue, yeah? <laughs> what? Some people it is gone. That this was possibly a spirit that manifested and that stands in relation with the temple nearby. Could this be so? Oh. If that's not the case, maybe we just became witness to a strange camera occurrence. Perhaps even that an was artifact. Weird. Who can say? But it just disappears straight away. A car passes and is gone. Playtime. This video was recorded by a CCTV camera of an older apartment building. It is mounted to the ceiling of the 13th floor. And many tenants have stated that they have heard quite a lot of eerie noises at night on there. Items have been moved around. And one tenant in particular swears that he saw a little kid running across the dimly lit hallway around midnight. Only to disappear into the closed door to the staircase. Oh. Strange to say the least. In this particular clip, we can apparently become witness to some of these mysterious events. Take a good look. I will. Playing ball. What? You can chuckle the ball as well. That ball moves so weirdly. Yeah? How is this possible? Holy toaster, man. What's going on? After oh, a few minutes of inexplicable activity, we can see a pair of flags appear. Yeah. Seemingly walking slowly towards the camera. This apparently freaked the superintendent out quite a bit, and who can blame him? And only a few minutes later, Would that creep this you happened. Up? I'm definitely creeped out. I 
I would call a priest. What? It was clear that the building was dealing with something really creepy here. What exactly it was, impossible Burn some to sage. say of course. Seems like the tenants of this building will have to keep those doors locked overnight for Burn sure Burn down though. the house. Do something. I would move out of there. Yesterday. A ghostly hospital. This is a recording from user Terror Latente, who tells us that he is working at an old hospital that he believes to be certainly haunted. He's hearing strange voices on the hallways where no patient is supposed to be out anymore and saw quite a few shadows over the past few months. Tonight, after hearing the voice of what sounded like a little girl, he pulls his cell phone out and started recording while he was strolling through the different corridors to catch the origin of these sounds. It, but the man believes that we can see the spirit of a girl here in a white dress. I thought at first that this was perhaps a garbage bin or medical equipment of some sort. Yeah, or but a the man copy machine. That nothing was placed in this room. I tend to believe him after seeing what their security system has captured the same night. I thought it was a copy machine or something. You know? It's a shadow creep. Looks like a child, yeah? It's, uh, it's not very high, tall. It's very small, not tall. Oh, that's weird, man. Who the F are you? Creeping around? Just zigzagging, you know? I don't know where to go. Go left, go right, go the up, The dark go shadow down. apparition that is coming out of the wall and then hovering around on the hallway before it vanished into the wall again. I'm sure that we all can agree That's that weird. something otherworldly was at play here. That's weird, really man. Creepy. It's really creepy, yeah. In the back of my neck. In the back this video of was my recorded neck. by the home security system of a residence that is said to host quite the number of spirits. The team of young enthusiasts was over that night to investigate the matter. It is unclear if they were trying to actually help the owners at the time or if this was more of a curious adventure. Whatever the reason, the security system captured something interesting. Oh, yeah. Let's check it out. Not a shadow creep. Oh, it threw something. The girls seem to freak out a bit when they hear a knock at the end of the hallway. It's not clear what exactly it was, but it sounds to me like an object was falling down. Look at this girl. She's uh, she's she's gone. She's the f out of there. Down. Oh no! Not we dealing with that. We also can see something peeking from the left corner. Oh, I didn't see that at and first. And there's also a bright object appearing right behind the couch. Look. The security camera captured it only for a moment. Maybe it was one of the spirits that are causing mischief in this home. What do you oh. believe? That lurker up in the corner, that, 
that gave me shivers down my spine. And it gave me the chills that are multiplying. Look at that, a pale face with a black eye. Yeah? You creepy man. Playing fire, fighting fire with now fire. We're taking a look at another really mysterious recording, which was captured by men at the gathering that took place at a friend's apartment. Foolishly, the group decided to take part in a Ouija board session, and a few moments after, the following recording was captured. Don't effing do Ouija board, kids. You're just inviting demons into the house. Don't do it. Just don't. Thank me later. Nobody had any idea who this was, as the group of friends were all situated in the living room. Which is why they believe That's only that this legs. was actually a spirit or a demon of some sorts. There's no upper body. Maybe they opened the door and invited this thing in. Yeah. Wouldn't be the first time after all that something like that happened, right? Don't do Ouija boards. Look at those legs. They're completely white. Go get some sun. Ghost boy. Or a the ghost next video girl. was forwarded by Mania Trent, and it is said that in the following clip, a security camera in the Broadway Palace apartment complex in Los Angeles might have caught an actual ghost. User Pooperness has shared the following video. <laughs> Apparently, the user, who works as a security officer, noticed oh. something really strange on one of the lower security cameras. In his Pooperness. own words, he tries to explain what he saw that night. I recorded this from the CCTV at my job, and they fired me for it. I usually don't believe in ghosts, but this video is creepy. I recorded it around midnight on March 12th. What is that? Under the staircase? Is it this? Looks like a little bit like it does Casper. Look a bit yeah? strange, doesn't it? Of course, you know. it looks like Casper, the friendly ghost, right? Can I keep you? Never know if it wasn't an insect or something. But many people commented on I the love fact that, that this ghost boy or whatever it was seemed to be walking towards the corner and then yeah. just vanished, which is really strange, wouldn't you agree? It's Casper. Are we looking I'm at sure a paranormal incident here? Or what was going on that night? That's weird, man. Aunt at home. So if you followed me from the beginning, back when I lived in the house, you would remember that I've been followed by a man in a top hat. You could totally see a face in here, I swear, looking at me. Um, but ignore all the stuff in the hallway I just moved in yesterday, so it's been a hot mess unpacking. The next series of videos were shared by I'm Into You. The young woman states that she moved into an old house, and her bedroom in particular seems to feel a little bit off, based on her own statements that is. Inexplicable noises, weird smells, and things that can be seen at night that are just frightening. After a few weeks living that nightmare, she has moved into a camper next door, because she just couldn't sleep in the house anymore. At that time, she was asking for help from some paranormal experts. Is there somebody here? Hello? You guys heard that, right? Hello? Hello, is there somebody here? Hello? Hello? Can you make a noise? Yeah, so I did see the orb. this is the one with a man. I don't know if you can see right there is his top hat. 
Um, you can see like his collar. Uh, it's super f***ing scary to me. For me, there's no denying that there is a man sitting there watching me in bed. That's pareidolia, yeah? He means this is the hat. This is the eyes. And the penis nose. That's pareidolia, man. Wearing a top hat with right? giant ears, and it looks scary. And last right? one, this is a screenshot taken in my bedroom. I see the man with the hat staring directly into the camera at me. She certainly believes that a man in a top hat is haunting her house. That's Pertolia, man. I think she means this is the hat, this is the eyes, and this is the mouth. Come on now. And likes to stalk her in her bedroom, unsettling. Her commenters believe that something paranormal is going on here. And when looking a bit closer into the matter, Indy states that even before moving into this new house, she had quite a few strange paranormal experiences during her entire life. It all started when she was a little kid. Okay, I'm gonna compile all the photos that I think of, I have of this same woman from my childhood photo. This is a screenshot from one of my orb videos and then the lighting was enhanced. Uh, looks like a girl with her arm on the table watching me. No, it doesn't. Bed. I definitely noticed the strands of hair across her forehead. And I sorry, don't. this is so grainy, but this is the first picture just really zoomed in of a printed out photo of me as a child. But I see the black hair across her face, always looking through that hair. Now, That's pareidolia. While all of these captures could be explained off as something else, of course, what followed in the next few days got more and more skeptics to believe that maybe there actually was a chance that Indy was being watched by something. In from one of my lives, like two days ago, um, during the lives, so many people kept saying that there were faces in the window behind me, but I honestly thought that people were just trying to scare me until I received this screenshot today and let me zoom in a little bit for you You'll yeah because i don't see anything i can clearly see a face peeking over the ledge before going live on her profile that night she also noticed something strange this is not impressing me i'm sorry do you guys see anything in this do you believe these are faces I think they're pareidolia, man. Right? Peering straight across from her Don't room, you agree? Some say it looks like a face. And after doing her live stream that night, her viewers saw something behind her that many believe to be an actual shadow figure. Not called shadow figures, it's shadow creep. Oh. That looked like something. That's that a proper shadow creep. Here, something negative that had attached itself to her. A pretty creepy thought, to be honest. Why Why is the quality of, of the camera so bad? Is this the first camera of phones that was made? Nokia 3033 or something? Look at this. This is proper quality. This is just potato, man. Why? A yeti. This video was captured and shared by Andy Capt. Oh, he I've was seen on a this trip one. With a friend the following day. I've he seen this one. He started recording when he saw something unusual in the distance on top of a mountain. Both drive this road a lot, so there should not have been any Look surprises how huge this in the is. landscape. That's for sure. It's huge. Who the F is that? No, seriously, pull over, pull over. <laughs> I don't have a pullover, I only have my shirt. And a polo. Sorry, let's continue. It's a person standing there. No, it's not. Dude, have you seen what I've seen right now? <laughs> that is weird, yeah? It's humongous. What's interesting is that whatever we are seeing here would have to be extremely tall since this mountain.
and it's not just a lonely tree, you know. Top is pretty far in the distance. Was it a tree, perhaps? No, says the uploader. Why should there only be this one day, tree? They have no idea what they saw there that afternoon, and they never saw it again. Quite mysterious, to say the least. Yeah, what do you think? I do think. What do you guys think? That was all. Thank you all for watching. Check out this recommended video, or maybe it's on this side. And there's a playlist also in one of them. And subscribe by clicking my portrait down there. Thank you all for watching. Until next time, bye bye.